Hi everyone, welcome to Healthy Indian Recipes. Today I'm going to show you a very quick and a tasty recipe using besan, coconut and jaggery. So let's begin. Heat a pan on medium to low flame and add 2 tablespoons of ghee also called as clarified butter. As the ghee starts to melt, add around 1 cup of besan also called as gram flour. Now roast the besan on a very low flame for around 2 to 3 minutes. Keep stirring the mixture continuously. Once all the ghee is absorbed and if you feel the mixture becomes too dry, add 2 teaspoons of ghee and combine everything together. Now after 20-25 minutes, a smooth paste will be formed. Keep stirring the mixture constantly. The mixture would have turned aromatic. Now we will add roughly 1 cup of desiccated coconut. You could use fresh coconut as well but just dry roast it before adding it to the basin mixture. Now saute this for around 2 to 3 minutes on a medium to low flame. Keep stirring continuously. Now we will add 1 4th teaspoon of cardamom powder also called as elaichi. Next we will add 1 tablespoon of flax seed powder. This is completely optional. 1 4th cup of crushed nuts. I am using cashews, pistas and almonds here. Now combine everything together and saute this for additional 1 minute. After around a minute, turn off the flame and keep this mixture aside. Now in a separate pot, take half a cup of water. Add half a cup of jaggery. Now bring everything to a boil. We are making the chashni here. If you do not have jaggery, you could use sugar as well. After a while, the mixture will start to thicken. Boil the mixture to a stage till you get one string consistency. Now add the chashni into the basin mixture. Now combine everything together. The mixture will gradually start to thicken. Now grease a plate with ghee. Add the besan mixture to the plate and spread it evenly. Now garnish with sliced almonds and pat it with spatula again. Now let it cool for around 15 to 20 minutes. After the barfi has cooled down, cut the barfi using a sharp knife. And our besan and coconut barfi is ready to be eaten. I hope you like this recipe. Do give it a try and let me know how it turned out for you in the comments below. Please subscribe to my channel and like this video. Thank you.